Wait, one second, mate. Can you record on that? Should be recording now. Okay, hello and welcome back to some Minecraft from Paradise Gold Age, episode 833. I think that's what we're on, 33 or 34. I don't know. I lost track a little while ago, but hopefully you are all doing okay today and seeing it. Where'd you come from? There's not been a turtle spawned around here and. A chicken? That's quite an odd sight. That is quite an odd sight. We've not had uh, a few mobs spawn here in a while. And also my fist is still broken. Don't know why that. Ah, it's because I have that in my inventory, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, let me put it back in the inventory. Put the Ender Lantern reveals nearby ours. That? You know what? I think I will tame you. You want one? Eat. Eat. You know what, this is exactly what the turtle looks like when it slipped over, I tell you. Eat. 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 Oh, wait, we got it, we got it. Hmm. No, 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 no. Capital Q, capital Q. Oh, I was hitting caps lock, not shift. Ah, okay. I was wondering why it was not going capitals there. Quinn. Quinshell. That's your name, Quinshell. Quite a good name. Quite a good name. Okay, you can come with me. Looks like we got a new buddy, I tell you, today. <laughs> that was quite unexpected. I just turned to my right and then I just started to walk and then, you know, I didn't expect to see a turtle here. It's been a little while since we have a turtle just hanging around my base and I really need to get stairs there. You know what? There's a crafting table there. I'm just gonna slap some uh, slab in there. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. Well, you know what? I do want to say something. I really need to work on this entrance over here. I'm thinking about remodeling the entrance, but I don't know how I will remodel it. Hmm. Question is, I could have moved this over here, this building over there, and then did a kind of like a round upwards, like you know, slabbing upwards, like it slowly just goes do -do 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 up into that bit there. So I could do that, that could work. Hmm. Hmm. I'm thinking about it, I tell you, I'm thinking about it. Put the slabs there, right? Yeah. You know what, I think it's nice having a little slab there. Okay, let me go put this in our storage over here. Yeah, it's still over here. Sorry, I was not too sure when we were uh, reconstructing the place that we, you know, destroy the chest or not. And then move it over. No, we did not. I think I moved one of the chests, because there is a chest in there, but I think that might be wrong. Wait. Oh, sorry, I saw, I saw ink sacks in there. No, it's a tar drop. I wish I had some ink. Wish I had some ink. I tell you, ink is the rarest thing in my world. And you need it to craft so many different stuff. And I just cannot get it. Now, I can get it from squid. And that's, you know, the most common. But the problem is there's two squid mods. Well, there's two mods that, you know, spawn two different squids. And also ignore that sound. That was, uh, you know, something else entirely. Uh, but look at all the cool stuff that we could make. I could make a typewriter. I would love to have one of those just sitting around, you know, for decoration. A jungle fancy workbench. We need to build one of those at some point, I tell you. Need to build one of those at some point. Yeah, there's just so much that you can build with ink. And then I'm never going to get around to doing any of that because I don't have ink in my world. You know... I, you know, I feel more like that one person, uh, Mog Swamp, who does, uh, the Slat World survival series. That's been going on for quite a while. I actually remember watching them back in, like, 2017, 2018. Yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's around that time. Around those three years, so 2016, 2017, 2018. Somewhere around that time that I watched them. Only, like, a few episodes, though. I was watching them because I was bored. <laughs> uh, not the best thing to say, but you know, I was very bored that day because I had nothing to do. 
so just decided to watch random Minecraft series. And that was one of the series that I came across. Ah, uh, let's see. But it reminds me of his series, because in their series, they just, uh, what do you call it? They just, uh, I'm trying to think of how you describe it. Hmm. They're, due to, well, here, here's how it goes. So when you're going up the update for Minecraft, right, in Slat World, you can no longer get rabbits. And also, the thing's not he Lord Harchill, what did I say? I was not going to slash him with my sword, I was just trying to get my backpack. There we go. I tell you, I can There's so many, you know... I really need to relocate all these, don't I? I really need to relocate these. You know what I really need to do? Add some lights around here. I think I forgot to do that a while ago. But also I do want to say last episode we did go mining. So I do need to go and unpack a bunch of the stuff that we got from mining. I'm trying to get a layup there I tell you. Nah it's too out of reach. Well that sounds pretty lit. Yeah that should do. That should do. If you're wondering where the little guy is. I'm pretty sure he's either teleported backwards. Or he's actually just uh, invisible until I relog. So we'll we'll see him next episode. <laughs> And they might be a little bit bigger by then, as the other turtle grows when you tame it. Hmm, do not need potatoes to now. But I was thinking about adding some bookshelves to my uh, area here, I tell you. I'm actually thinking about, uh, because I want to do a total remodel of uh, this hallway at some point. Well, not a total remodel. A remodel of the walls. I do want to, well, I wanted to talk about this idea to you. I am thinking about taking our lab and then basically, how would you describe it, making it look abandoned, putting like cobwebs everywhere, and also you see that by the new thumbnail that we have for uh, Halloween time as well, but I want to put like cobwebs all over the place and kind of make it look a little bit abandoned, you know, it's outdated, it's old, and then I want to build a new lab soon, but I don't really know where we got to build a new lab, I tell you that now. We'll build a new lab soon, I tell you. But what I wanted to talk about with our rabbits and our dogs, is I want to do a total remodel of this room here. I know I can go this way, because this is where the cat room is. So I'm thinking about expanding it long-wise, but kind of maybe thinking about shortening it over this way. Like I was thinking about just having you know, one glass pane here, and just moving the wall to somewhere around there. That is just because underneath this is my potato farm. So that is why I wanted to uh, build the wall there to kind of negate that problem. That's probably the best way to say it. Stop that problem from you know, happening. Because I've accidentally... Uh, well, I had to actually make the pool smaller because of that issue. I would love to have the pool and, you know, some other stuff. You know what, Dennis, you can join me today. We won't be doing too much, you know, in the wilds today, so... Hmm. You know what, I could actually do that today. I would actually need to check the supplies. I do actually have some, uh, white concrete. But white concrete is not what I actually use for the main bit here, because it's all on white concrete, to describe it a bit better. So I do have a lot of white concrete, to, I guess I could do the... If you did not know, when I originally built this place I only did the outside because I was very low on uh, white concrete at the time. So a lot of the outside is just uh, white concrete and then the insides of certain bits of my base is just, you know, the other stuff that we used, white terracotta. So I guess we might as well get started and just start breaking down some of the stuff. If you're wondering what the beds are there, those are my cat beds, for my cats, that I do not really keep out because they normally get stuck on your head from the Minecraft No Creatures mod. So, uh, Percy and Gronk. Gronk named after a non-binary friend that we had in, uh, hmm, I'm trying to think, you know, what SMP, ah, Creations SMP. They were the owner of Creations SMP. They were quite a good person, I tell you. Quite a good person. I've always wanted, you know, you know, well, I've always 
thought about the idea. Maybe one day we'll do, you know, Creations SMP 2.0. But that probably won't ever happen, I tell you. Eh, we'll see. I keep it in mind, you know, that series every once in a while. I miss that series. I quite enjoyed Creations SMP, though they were all only three. It, you know, it started to get very good at a certain point, and that's when, uh, what do you call it? They were doing all of these event stuff. It was cool, the event stuff, right? They did, like, a, what, what events for it? I'm trying to think of the events, but try and put it into, you know, not a garbled mess. Ah, uh, let's see. I'll put the torches in there now. But, let me try and think. Let me try and think, I tell you. So, I always loved the, what do you call it? The command block quest that they did. Yeah. I always loved the command quest. You know what? I'm, I'm probably going to restart this whole conversation, I tell you. Probably going to restart this whole conversation. So, Garonk is the owner of Creations SMP, and I do quite miss the SMP, I tell you. I always think about it every once in a while. It, it never really got a proper send off. That's what I'm going to say. It never really got a proper send off. So it's kind of, you know, an SMP that never got a true end. And that's what I feel, you know, bad about it. I wish it got a true end. I wish it, you know, continued. Because I feel like, you know, it would have been a great SMP, I tell you. It probably would have lasted a bit longer, I tell you. Probably would have been a little bit longer. There we go. You coming, Dennis? Dennis is sometimes getting broke on their beds. I always loved the idea of, you know, command blocks and uh, SMP to give you these, uh, like, trivia questions and stuff like that. I always like that kind of stuff. Hmm. Let me just start, uh, tearing down this old wall. If you're wondering why this wall was just a jumble of different colours, it was kind of like a poo bear kind of face. But also kind of like, you know, what people have at kindergarten. Normally they have like a rainbow or something like that. Uh, I really like it like that. It doesn't look too bad. But all of this behind here is going. Ah, uh, let's see. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'll just uh, take that bad king. You good king? Yeah. Okay, let me nudge you back over there. You okay, Dennis? Yeah? Okay. Dennis is good. Let me grab all of them. And I guess we'll start breaking that away. And I guess I'll just start filling it in. Dennis, I'm probably going to have to l make you sit down a second. Really? Okay, you can sit out here. But no going down these stairs. I don't want to eat my potatoes. It's not going to be like that one video of that dog eating the old tomatoes. If you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> uh, I love that video. I love that video, I tell you. Great video. Uh, let's see. I guess I could just break that bit there, right? I'll just do that for now. I do want to, you know, refine the roof of our uh, potato farm. I actually want to do a reconstruction of our entire potato farm. Eh? It sounds like a lot, but it, is, it probably will be a lot. Because I have to rebuild the entire system of how we get all of the, you know, potatoes and all that. Where'd they go? I really love what we had now. But I'm thinking about backing it up to an older model that we have of it. I'm thinking about this kind of idea. Thinking about that kind of idea. Hmm. Oh, that, that would be funny. Sorry. I saw a uh, idea there. You know how Iron Man has all of these suits just, you know, all on the, you know, stands and all that? I saw about that because uh, I might as well give you a little bit of a spoiler. 
but I am planning on doing a new mod update to the series adding some new mods to the series that being wolf armor and penguins kind of what they're adding to the newer update of minecraft and now in like two days you know what I find uh, you know what I really like how they're you know you went with these uh, I was wondering what that was okay I'm gonna you know take a second to just uh, do a little bit of chit chat also there's some more terracotta in here I could finish three of these little bits and then a tiny bit of the this one there it looks like a tiny house. <laughs> uh, but I really, I really like how they're adding you know, more mobs to uh, Minecraft. But the mob vote is kind of very outdated. I wish it was like, you know, a group for a certain biome. You know, like, oh, we're adding the armadillo with a ostrich with a something else. Another mob. Stuff like that. I feel like that's what they should have been doing with, you know, the mob vault. Adding multiple mobs to a certain time. As I feel like, you know, that would be good. You know, it populate the world a bit better. But then, you have the armadillo, right? You have the armadillo. What are you looking at? Sick iron. So you have the armadillo. That you will have to kill for a shell that you can only use for wolf armor. I'm feeling, you know... They didn't want to add sharks to uh, Minecraft due to animal abuse. Because, you know, people hunt their fins. But tell them kids, you know, oh, we're adding the armadillo and you have to kill it for wolf armor. Sounds a bit cruel, doesn't it? For, you know, people that did not want to add sharks to the game. Because people would just, you know, attack it. I feel like if they added sharks it should just be like a dolphin it's not really attacking you because sharks don't actually attack you it was just the jaws movie made everyone think you know oh this is how sharks actually act but it's not but uh it's kind of dull this uh mob boat that's what i'm going to say it's kind of dull this mob boat i like the penguins the penguins are nice but i wish they would add more to each man because it feels like it's got to be like the fox like when the armadillo is just chilling it's just got to be in a biome of emptiness. What spawns in the, you know, savannah? Nothing but an armadillo and then mobs at night. So there's really nothing in the savannah for, you know, stuff like that. I wish they would do like a full update to the savannah and they were going to do that with the biome, you know, boat stuff. But, uh... I feel like you're just adding one mob to a biome that's so empty. It's just got to end up like the fox. you got to see it for a while. It's got to be quite cool. People have got to take it back to their base. But in about a year, it's all got to be died down. And no one cares about the armadillo no more. So it's a cool mob. Just no one cares. And then, right, if you add penguins, they're just got to be in an ice biome with polar bears. And a little bit of a fact there. Polar bears and penguins are not on the same continent as, you know, certain, you know, people believe that. They're not on the same continent. That being, you know, Antarctica and Arctic. They're both different, you know, species on different, you know, bits. Antarctica is where penguins reside and Arctic is where polar bears reside. Because the ancestor of the polar bear would go up there, up north. And also, I do have a little bit of a history fact. There was a ginormous bear that was a polar bear that uh, attacked many tribes back in that time. And it went missing one time and they never saw it again. It wasn't until, like, many, you know, years later that, yeah, they knew about the stuff and then they found the skull of it and it was, like, huge. Because if you did not know... There is uh, very big bears that have existed in the world. So that is probably one of the biggest, you know, polar bears ever to exist. I think it was a polar bear. But the biggest bear that's ever existed... Well, yeah. The biggest bear to ever exist was uh, back a long, long time ago when the animals migrated over to North America through a land bridge. 
and the descendant of the biggest bear is the last short nosed bear in Peru, I'm pretty sure that's where it's from now. Some Peru. It's quite sad, I tell you, it is quite sad. I'm not sure what we got in here. Yeah, we have quite a lot of, you know, frozen stuff in here, I tell you. Quite a lot of frozen stuff. I really love these lights. I used to always do lights like this for, like, my base and all that back in the day. Good times, good times, I tell you. I'll see. I'm looking for a... It's not glass that I'm looking for, it's, uh... The other stuff. And then back to that crab thing. Crab things are pretty cool, though, you know, because they're probably adding crabs due to, you know, what do you call it? The developer of uh, more creatures was, you know, hired by... Hired by Mojang. That's a pretty nice view. That is a pretty nice view, I tell you. Ah. I love views like that, I tell you. Love views like that. Okay. So back to the crab thing. So the crab thing's just got to be extended reach for building, right? I feel like it's kind of got to be overpowered because one thing that I want to know is that I think I already know the question to it. That is, if they're doing, you know, it for only building, does that mean one day that they might add something for PvP? Extended weaponry. So like, you know, a spear maybe. Something like that. But then they already have the trident, so it doesn't really make sense, huh? I guess a slow, you know, pointy spear attack. And then, what do you call it? I always wondered, would they add it to be able to pick up water? So you could, you know, put a bucket on a crab claw to pick up water and lava. Because lava and water can be used in PvP. But then I'm pretty sure they're just using it on blocks only. So what counts as actually a block? Because this is a block of glass sometimes, so you could place glass. But can you place glass panes? Or fences? Would fences count as a block? So it's really, you know, a very weird, you know, what do you call it? Problem. Well, we could just call it a problem now. A very weird, uh, well, not problem, problem, but uh, a theory. It could be a problem for, you know, the update. Ah, we'll see. But they're probably just gonna pick whatever is a solid, full block. So does that mean you can't place half slabs? Hmm. Sorry, sometimes I get into these talks and all that. But you know, the crabs are cool, but I wish they were added with, you know, other stuff. And they're not gonna be able... Well, I'm gonna tell you something. They're not actually going to spawn on beaches. And it's kind of stupid, because I feel like they should spawn on beaches, right? It feels like, you know, they should spawn on beaches with turtles and all that. But no, they're not going to be spawning on beaches with turtles. Such a weird thing, is, isn't it? Huh? Where's my red shulker? Ah, let's see. I'm looking for a terracotta stack and I took that one. There we go. Let me check on Burns. How you doing, Burns? You doing good? You eating my bushes again? How could you? How could you? Nod, Argot, Snowball, Wojtek, and... Just double checking there's no one... Ah, there's Bubbles. I hear Bubbles. There you are, Bubbles. Bubbles! Kevin, how are you doing? You okay, Bubbles? What are you doing, Bubbles, eh? What are you doing? You know what, we really need to head to the end to start doing that end project, I tell you. And that's something I do want to talk about that I just got reminded of. I have a build planned for November and December. That being, I wanted to build a build in our snow biome. It's probably got to be somewhere over here, I tell you. Somewhere over here. Quite far, I tell you. Quite far. And this build is actually going to be Santa's workshop. Or maybe up here, yeah. Santa's workshop. We'll be building a ginormous town. And I'm going to need some help on uh, coming up with some ideas for that one. So if you want to leave any uh, suggestions down below, you can leave that down below. 
It always helps, I tell you. It always helps. I don't know why there was a broken block there. Hmm. Maybe I broke it by mistake there. A little while ago. And then five blocks would only cover that. But I do have some more stone in the backpack. That I was supposed to empty out a while ago. But who cares. Yeah. There we go. Not bad, not bad at all. You know what, we're starting to get a, you know, hold of something here. Starting to get a hold of something. Glow fire, new. I never, you know, really think how close stuff like that is. Eh, let's see. I'm actually gonna have to go on a little bit of a hunt for my... my other stuff. Where is it? I'll have to harvest my potatoes soon. Hmm. Hmm. Where is my red shulker? Not in my inventory, of course. Hmm. Getting worried, I tell you. I'm getting worried. Hmm. Where would my wood shulker be? I'm getting worried that I might have lost my wood shulker. In the ravine. Could have happened, could have happened. Let's uh let's continue walking. Well it's not over here. Though I do want to remodel this cage over here. That's the mod that I needed to add, I totally forgot about it. The golden lasso mod. Well, it's not called the Golden Lasso mod. Something else. What are you? Spruce leaves. I should really have named that. Sheep unknown. Natulius crisis ended of February 2023. It didn't really fully end. I've, I've you know subsided it for now. I think that's a word for it. Hmm. Don't know why I'm checking down here. I should fall down here and then make my way over to the ravine just to make sure it's not in the ravine. Sorry, bad habit. I've always thought about uh, strapping a TNT to it and then uh, seeing, you know, if I blew it up at some point <laughs> by accident. Uh, I always thought about that. Thought it would be a funny idea, I tell you. Thought it would be a funny idea. Because I would eventually forget that the TNT is behind it, click the button, and it would blow up. <laughs> uh. Yes, I know it's kind of stupid, but you know. I thought it would be funny. I thought it would be funny. One day it just goes boom. Oh! I don't have either of my shulkers, it's because I was working down here. We're mining out this roof here. You know what, I will actually uh, finish that last strip there. Actually, I can't finish that last strip there. I have to go on this bit here. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. That's a lot of uh, gravel I better harvest. There we go, not bad, not bad at all. Yeah, I think this is starting to take shape, I tell you. Starting to take shape. We were building a little bit of a little area here, I tell you. And I think it's working out quite well, this area. I was planning on uh, making it connect with the area that's going to be down there. But then I'm not too sure about that idea too much. So I'm thinking about something else for it. 
not fully yet, but you know, I'm thinking of ideas. That's what I'm gonna say. I'm thinking some ideas for that area. Wait, what? I could have just put it in there. I noticed that when I put it into my inventory, you know, just at like, you know, a millisecond before. Yeah, that works. That works out pretty good. There we go. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. You know what? I quite enjoy this area, I tell you. The roof, you know, expanded makes this area look a lot better. And definitely gonna have to do it with this side over here. Yeah. Yeah. Don't know why one of the blocks there are missing. I guess I didn't have enough at the time. I guess I did not have enough at the time. But we will, uh, make sure to mine that all. Now, I better go grab my, uh, wood shulkers because I. I might forget to do so, and I do not want to do that. Wait. I know what I need to do. Wait, this is mostly just resources. I'll just take that back to the house. There we go. And now that we have our, you know, shulkers, now I can go and... You know what? I was so worried that, you know... The shulker was in the, uh, you know, ravine, and I'd taken that long that might despawned. Luckily, they were just placed there. Luckily. I don't know why I thought that. I don't know why I thought they would be in the ravine. I just got to, you know, mine open that roof there if I did not see them. And I'd just hop into the ravine again, check around. Would have been a waste of time, though. No? <laughs> uh, would have been a waste of time. But that does not matter now, as we have our shulkers. Now that that, you know, is all sorted out, we have to work on our dog room. I'll just call it the dog room for now. The dog room. And there you are, dog room has, you know, been, you know, around for so long now. Been around for so long now. Hello there, Dennis, how you doing? You good? You can, you can walk now. Come on. Let's get to building, I tell you. Let's get to building. Like, I am going to change the walls out there, so... It's kind of, you know... You know, not really necessary to do this now. So, you know, eventually I want to do the outside wall, but who cares? Who cares, I tell you? Who cares? I like the lights in here, but better uh, put in the new lights, I tell you. Put in the new lights, that's glowstone to be more exact. Oops, did not mean to do that. Sorry. Is it Karen? Dog's just getting in the way, I tell you. There we go. Probably the brightest room in the house now. <laughs> uh, break that, and then break that. I guess it would have to go like that. 
so it would be exactly the right length. And I'm definitely going to have to break that now. And I've just sort of a good idea. Just sort of a good idea. I'm going to put that back. I might sneeze in a second. I do apologise. Oh. 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 The pain. I might sneeze soon. Here. Check a line and you can... Well, you can just stand there. It's just a random check line. You know what? It's Halloween. Soon. You can go in there. There we go. Halloweenified. I need to put more around base, I tell you, for Halloween. Then we'll have to clean them up after Halloween. <laughs> uh. Right, what was it doing? Ah. That's what I need. Ooh, nope. Twenty end rods. Might need to make a little bit more. Wait a bit. Ah! I forgot about all of this. We need to go there soon, I tell you. I just... Wait, what? What? What was all of that? What was all of that? That that was crazy. I just wanted to click on this one thing down here. I really hate that now. Really hate that. Okay, well I think I'm going to end it here just because it's at very six minutes. So have a nice day, safe, hope to simple. Maybe some more shoes. Need the vitamins very important. I'm very safe, thanks for having CCs. Bye bye.